Hi there, my name's <coughs> sorry. Hi there, my name is Cunnenberg and welcome to my channel. Uh, this is Civilizations uh, 5. I've done quite a few playlists already, so I thought I'd do another one. Um, also, uh, one of my subscribers, who's you know, is a very good uh, good guy. Um, I know he likes Civilizations, and I asked him if he'd like to see another one, so he said yes. Now I'm not uh, an elite player. I don't go out there and dominate the do the you know I don't play on the hardest level I just play for fun so I'm gonna have a go well I have a go all the time so uh, what I'm gonna do is I had to look on Steam some of my achievements I still haven't done so my leader is gonna be Ram keying where's he this guy Apparently, um, so I'm going to select him. Now the map type, uh, apparently Pagian type, which I'm assuming is that one. I don't sh I assume there's no other Pagian type. There's a Pangia there. I think that's the same one. Um, it's the same thing. Explorers. Yes, I've, I've, as you can tell, there's Pangia plus. There's so many, I, I will be, I won't be doing them all on the recording, but eventually I'll be doing them all. Uh, I think it's a random app only picks these, which is a bit crappy. Um, but, yeah. So I'm going to pick... Ooh. Okay. Pangea. Uh, I'm going to actually, believe it or not, stick it on Chieftain in the game, purely because I just want to. <laughs> um... And I'll leave that as it is. The advanced setup, uh, leave all these as random, leave these, and I allow. We, I did a, a multiplayer game of this once with the Raging Barbarians. God, they were a, a pain in the backside. Okay, so we know what we're playing, and so that's okay. So we can click play, and here we go. Of the glorious Siamese people, ruler of Siam, an ancient country in the heart of Southeast Asia. Siam is a beautiful and mysterious land. Surrounded by foes, beset by bloody war and grinding poverty, the clever and loyal Siamese people have endured and triumphed. King Rom Komhang, your empire was once part of the Khmer Empire until the 13th century AD when your ancestors revolted, forming a small Sukhothai kingdom. Through successful battle and cunning diplomacy, the tiny kingdom grew into a mighty empire. An empire which would dominate Southeast Asia for more than a century. O oh, wise and puissant King Rom Komang, your people need you to once again lead them to greatness. Can you use your wits and strength of arms to protect your people and defeat your foes? Can you build a civilization that will stand the test of time? Uh, so I can't really say that very well. Um, so uh, we can build an elephant. Uh, and we can build the Watt. Um, so uh, what I have been doing on other... Um, even when I just play on with Todd, but I try to go for certain other little achievements like the playing, just, you know, the... Um, uh, going for the triangle things and you know, the science advisors and stuff like that. I can't remember which ones they are, but I'm just going to play the game for this one. Um, I might have a go at that another time. The obviously anybody that's played Civilizations or whatever knows is this bit is the fun part and the moving around, looking around, seeing what there is. It's the best part. Let's build my city. Sukutai. Um, so, we've got me warrior, uh, let's go and have a wander over here, uh, get a monument going first, it's the usual blurb, right I'm gonna, so th these are the things what I've, I've done before where I've gone like I'm just going for all these yellow ones, um, I'm just gonna go for all these no matter what they select, it's quite good fun actually if you want to have a difference you know when you play the game so you end up just doing science and stuff but I'm actually just going to try and get the stuff that I need so uh, I need my masonry 
masonry, masonry. There we go. So that's my masonry and mining, which is probably good because I've got that, which requires mining. Yay! Let's see what we've got. From what I gather, it's just one island. So we don't really need sailing, but there's obviously some little things over here. Yep, I met somebody. Ajisha Chukanchi. Nyukamikani Pachakutik. Inka Kunapagapa. Guaranteed a country. Okay, so we've met one civilized. If I fail miserably on this, I'll be very annoyed. I haven't played this game for months and months, unfortunately. Let's get that. Uh, I never go over scouts, they're a waste of time. Uh, I'm gonna go for the worker. The meek shall inherit the earth, but not its mineral rights. I'll leave these up so you can see them. There's some people might not have played this game before, so you know, whatever. Ooh, a city state. the one that gives me the free um see if that's the one we sell I mean uh. so it's a bit slow at first until actually something start kicking in but it happens. <laughs> Get that farming going. Get some food for my people. I know what I need, I need a worker. They're not a worker, uh, a warrior. Already? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is it? Old Faithful. How happy are those whose walls already rise? Yeah. <laughs> Let's get the mine going. Get some money. Uh, let's have a look. So we've got mining. We need calendar. I mean, you end up going for all this stuff anyway, but um, I'm gonna have another worker, which is a bit of a, a bit of a pain. But there you go. Oh, sweet, I love those. Uh, I need a warrior. I need to protect my base. Oh, 
Oh, bloody Nora. Let's just get these things and get out of here. Secret technology? Okay, that's the horses thing, I think. Oh, that's always a bonus. I need to. I need another settler anyway, but I'm gonna try and. Uh, A few barbarians died about. Shall the clay say to him that fashioneth it? What makest thou? Oh, right, okay. So. Farm. Get some production going. Gold is good. Get a granary gro go go up, up, granary going, and then I'm gonna have a cellar. I think. I don't have any wheat, do I? Um, not to it. Let's go for a cellar. I'll get a cellar anyway soon, but. There's something there. Is the water? I thought this was supposed to be one island. But... Oh, it's not. I thought there was a river. Uh, the sea. Inca runa kunaka. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. I love that. That's fine. Got anywhere near that? Yes. As long as they don't come charging towards me, I'm fine. It's just I, I don't have anything to upgrade them with. Oh, oh what's that? Yeah, I'm not gonna go for it. I'm having a look around. Well, I'm not going. Oh, they definitely want me, don't they? I like they want to be friends or something. So teach us to number our days, so that we may apply our hearts unto wisdom. Mhm. Mm Hang on a second. to build some modes I think as well but not for f <sighs> this is not what I need oh my god <laughs> let's bring them back here get out of here 
I don't engage with them unless I really need to. They were injured. Send these out a minute while I just put them there for the moment. What do they suggest? Food citizens. Food citizens, right. Oh, mamma mia. Okay. Well, we know where we are. Do all there? Why can't I do anything with bananas? What do only plantation? Ach, 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 ach. Sorry about that. I just want to get my archers built. begins. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, that's not good. Oh, no, that's the barbarians. Oh, well. as well, oh my god. I might need to uh, change my tactics and go for some um, military stuff because there's a bit more of them that I actually didn't think there'd be that many. Um, where are you suggesting for me to go? What, over there? Where's the one that's next to the um, uh, old faithful? There it is. I'm also trying to get it so I can go across there. Maybe I should go there. Although well, I really need to go up here, don't I? And see what's up here. Not 
lost to that. We're going down there with them. Oh, I need some archers. Oops. Need some archers, and I need um. Open, there's no one there. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change my tactics. This is getting pretty shitty. Arch as simple as that. And I also need to probably move away from my normal route, um, which is not what I normally do, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. I know I look like I'm actually doing quite crappy, and that's probably because I am. <laughs> I'm going through the motions here, I need to get, to get sorted with stuff. Oh no, that was something else. Oh, wait a minute. How bizarre. Is it not letting me pick that? Oh, so I've already got him. <laughs> Duh! really boost my city up with everything I can bloody well muster. So I'm going to get archers. I'm going to have two archers per city. Um, and the warriors can go wandering off in a minute.
Money's good. Building a road. What if we just finish an archer? Right, I need to do an archer something, an archer something, an archer something. I have to go production, go protection here because this is just pretty miserable. Uh, right, I'm going to protect them there. Need to um. Oh, iron. Where's iron? On my home city. Well, that's not gonna happen, is it? Right. So there's iron there. That's fine. Uh, let's get an archer. Oh no. We'll leave the archer at the main place there. Um. What do I need? I suppose we need sailing for the fishing boats there, so let's go for that. And I think when my policies and I can get my Might go for liberty. Um, and I might have to go for honor. So. Where am I looking? Oh, there. Let's get an archer going. So connect the two cities, which means they'll grow a bit faster. I'll try and do the same here, or get a harbour going. But with all the barbarians floating around, I definitely need to do. Um, right, so we got archer. There. We got archer. The archer down here. I want to get two archers per base. Oh no, actually, an archer, a, a warrior, an archer, a warrior, an archer, and a warrior to start with. And I'll send another set of warriors off wandering, see what we can find. Right, let's get this here. Uh, archer's been done. There's no point for the work boat yet. That's for the deer, isn't it? 